Hey guys, today is gonna be a cozy video. Today we're gonna do a thrift store, specifically Goodwill haul. Yeah, today's gonna be a little bit of a cozier uh, kind of vibe video. Oh look, I didn't even realize you could see my, my barber light <laughs> through here. It's cute. Here, let me show it to you. If y'all haven't seen it, look. Y'all see it? It's um, it's so pretty. It's from Amazon. My husband surprised me with it for my birthday. Yeah, my birthday. When I'm in the mood, I like to go thrifting. Okay, especially when I'm in the mood. When I'm in the mood, I like to I like to go to stores where there's not too much of the same repetitive things. Like I like to go and look look at different items. That's why I like to go to Ross, TJ Maxx, Home Goods because there's always something new. Ever since I was little, I've always enjoyed Every once in a while, garage selling, yard selling, thrifting, antique shopping. Go with my family to like festivals that have tents where they sell their homemade jewelry. Just kind of like different things everywhere you look and you pick up items that you like that are just so different, you know. But anyways, I still like to go every once in a while to Goodwill to see what like items I can find there kind of reminds me of yard sales or garage sales all indoors in a shop you know the reason I like those stores is because everything is different there's not one repetitive item I don't know maybe this video can inspire you to repurpose items collect maybe it's just for entertainment regardless don't forget to hit that like button if you do enjoy this video don't forget to subscribe if you have not already don't forget to push the bell and yeah let's just go ahead and get started Oh my gosh, you can definitely find some cute, cute things, okay? And I'm going to show you what little cute thing. By the way, by the way, I found a lot of little pink knickknacks, little pink stuff that's so cute. So anyways, that's what's going to be in here. So the first item is this one, of course. This one is just like a little travel bag. So basically you put here, hold on, price is $1.99. And of course, so many of these things are gonna be half off of the price, 75% off and 25% off. Every time you go to Goodwill, they're always gonna have like a sale, you know, off of whatever color tag that is. But anyways, this bag is so cute. Basically you fold this big bag up and then you put it in, or it comes out of this little bag right here. And then you can p attach it to your purse or for travel or whatever. It's just like a grocery bag. Look, you see, it's just like a grocery bag. And then once you're done with the bag, it's waterproof, by the way, uh, you just put it in here and then it has this little, this right here. See, isn't that adorable though? So I think maybe I got it for a dollar. Yeah. So there is that. And then inside, I got another little bag. So this one was a Vera Bradley. I just love the fact that it had long, here, long straps, which normally when you see a little tote bag like this, it has little short straps, but no, this one had long ones. Anyways, I love that it was a Vera Bradley. It, you know, it's brand new. It came with the cardboard here at the bottom. Thought it was so adorable. This one was, where's the price? 99 cents. Possibly could have been 75% off, half off, regardless. I think it is so adorable. In here I do have this, uh, oh and by the way, anytime you go thrifting, yard selling, garage selling, stuff like that, make sure you always wash all the items that you have, sanitize and all that stuff. But anyways, so I did find this Candies sunglass. I'm going to use it for reading glasses though. And again, this is brand new too. Look at that. I love the gold detail inside. And this one was 99 cents. Again, I'm not going to repeat it, but a lot of these items I have got them um, like all of them are on sale, you know? Yeah. I thought that that was really cute. Okay. So here I'll put them, whatever I get, I'll put them all in here. 
Okay, the next I picked up, oh yeah, this. So it's a little scooper, but look how cute. It says scoop of love. How adorable. So this was also brand new. You could tell whoever owned it, they just put it away somewhere and just never took it out. Uh, so this one was, let me see, $1.99. So it was probably a dollar. Yeah, I'm going to say all the regular prices on there and then you can assume it was on sale because normally, yes, it was on sale. But yeah, I, I'm picturing this for like a sugar scoop, you know, for coffee or something or like a Splenda scoop. So I picked up a couple other little bags. You can always find little bags like this. This one is kind of like a baby pink, like a makeup pouch, I guess. You can put lip glosses. This one again, unused, uh, 99 cents. I love the shade of pink. Okay, so then here is this one. So this one was $1.99 and I love how it's a gold sequence. Isn't that beautiful? Um, so this one, it does come with a mirror inside. This one may have been a little bit used, but again, I'm going to wash it, sanitize it, and it'll be ready to go. Okay, what else? Okay, yes, look at these. Or this, not these, because I only got one. Okay, so this one is just uh, yarn, or and it also says just yarn at 99 cents, and it's a very pale pink baby pink you can use this for whatever kind of crafting that you're doing so this is a hundred percent polyester and it's let me see 73 yards of yarn it's a pretty yarn too okay and then we have this little pink scarf so this one was 359 I was mainly wanting to use this for a purse, you know, you can use it as the scarf to put a bow on, you know, your handbag, your shoulder bag or whatever. So that's what I wanted to use this for. I love the shade of pink. That's why I picked it up. Very beautiful too. And it's sewed on at the edging really well. So this was a really exciting find for my handbags. So that is it for the pink items here. Let's go ahead and move on to more pink items, shall we? <laughs> well, you know what? I guess before we get to the other pink items, let me just tell you, I have been really into putting together some cute little books and stuff. Now, it does take some searching, okay? I, here, I'm gonna give you an example. Look how beautiful these books are as a cluster. It didn't take me one time to find all these. It does take work to come up with like a little set like this. It's not easy, but you know, maybe one time you'll find this book in this book. And then another time you'll find this book. And then the other time this book. Then you put them all together. You come home and then here's what you come up with. And then you can put it like on your shelf and put it on your end table with like a canister or something right there. I don't know. I love the design aspect of it. Yeah. Very, very beautiful. Let's go ahead and start with the first one. So this one says home spa relax. And this one was $1.99. And then I have this one, the life-changing magic of tidying up at $1.99. And I, I mainly look at the spine too, just to make sure it looks really pretty, you know, as a cluster of books. And then, oh my gosh, this one was the gem. This Beauty and the Beast Bell's Library book. What? For $1.99? Look at the spine. Oh my gosh. Beautiful, right? Wow. This was a gem for sure. Isn't that gorgeous? It's just beautiful. It's just, oh my gosh. I couldn't believe it when I found it. So there's that one. And then the next one I found was Tea Fit for a Queen. There's the spine. And then I love the color. Isn't that gorgeous? 
And then so it has different recipes in here. Love it. This one was $2.99. And then the last one for this cluster was this one. It's for $2.99 and it just says go getter. These ones you can find like at Marshalls and Ross and stuff. This one's by the brand C.R. Gibson. All it is is just a blank journal book. And the spine looks like that, kind of like a mint green, which matched all this. So that's why I end up getting that one too. Great decor idea. More books. Here are these. I'm telling you, look how beautiful they look. Yeah, the one that pops out is the Twilight. <laughs> I used to be so obsessed with Twilight and I'm, I still am like I can just put those shows on and just keep re-watching them over and over it's just so much nostalgia when I put a movie on from Twilight and it brings me back you know 99 cents for this one and this is the Twilight director's notebook the story of how we made the movie I don't know if there's... How freaking cool is that, right? Wow. <laughs> yeah. 99 cents. Okay, and then I found this one. Unicorn Magic. Three books in one. <laughs> How cute, right? It totally matches my beauty room. Yeah. Oh, that one. 99 cents adult coloring book so this one was 99 cents and this one of course was brand new and you can just color in here i like to do that on occasion this next one $1.99 it's called the nest this is like the kind of color books that i'm collecting for my living room i have like an entertainment center bookshelf that i'm putting together some clusters of books and um this fit that decor idea perfectly really really nice this was also a great find for me a dollar 99 and it's just a regular book okay next one look how cute this is cookies brownies and bars dozens of scrumptious recipes to bake and enjoy i love it right and then here are some recipes yeah and some of them have um, pictures, other ones don't. Ooh, look at that one. I love cheesecake, by the way. And then last but not least for the books is going to be this one. So this is the Field to Table Cookbook. And here is the spine. Look how beautiful the spine is. I love the shade of kind of like a sea green color, um, which this is going to go really well in my kitchen area these are such great decor books you guys if you are stuck like in a place like well what do i put here or what what do i put on top of the fridge that's gonna look um instead of cereal boxes what can i put on you know you can definitely put some large recipe books with a wicker basket and like a large one large candlestick just on top of your fridge and with a little light in the background you know and then make it look really cozy there just an idea this would be like $19.99 or $24 at Marshall's or Home Goods $1.99 which may have been a dollar okay so now we're gonna go on to more pink items look what I found brand new combination safe it is metal specifically for money at home you know like <laughs> i just think that that was so cute i have seen these on amazon so when i spotted it there i'm like heck yeah i think it was like a dollar 99 or i'm um, sorry a dollar 50 is what it was and you can put like little stickers you can yeah i think i'm gonna give it to my niece so that's why i got it and then next one i found this one so this one was 99 cents and i believe i got this for a quarter this is a Hobby Lobby find. See that? I don't know if I'm going to keep this back here and hang it somewhere or just take it off and put it like on my shelves and just kind of leave it like that. I, I may even put it in my, my guest bedroom. 
Now, you can always find containers. You can find, well, I guess I'll give you an example. Okay, the first one. I found this and I'm assuming it's it's a planter. You can put like a succulent or something. And this is specifically gonna be used for decor in my living room area. But anyways, I do plan on putting little fake succulents in here and just kind of using it as decor. They're little books, see? This one was 99 cents. Okay, and then next, this one was 99 cents. Just like a little saucer and um, I don't know. I just like to put little jewelry in here. I, I may use it for toothpicks in my kitchen area, but yeah, I don't know exactly what I'm going to use this for. I don't even know if it's real crystal. I don't think it is, but it looks really pretty. So this one is $1.99 and look how pretty. It's like a dipping bowl. I do have a larger dish and I do have a couple of smaller ones like this, but you can use these for the kitchen, for parties. We do like to host parties over here at my house, you know, with, with close friends and everything. So this I thought would come in handy sometime. And I may also use it for jewelry. Maybe you can put your watches, rings, earrings and stuff like that. Yeah, $1.99. This one looks crystal, by the way. I don't know if it is, but... Okay, more stuff, they always have these, always. This one I'm gonna use for sure for jewelry. I have a little spot up there on my Ikea shelves that I'm gonna put this on and I'm specifically gonna use it for my most used jewelry cause it can just kinda, it's like a catch all dish is what I'm gonna use it for. I think this may have been used as a I mean, I don't know. Was this an ashtray? Can y'all let me know what this was used for? 99 cents. We're almost done, almost done. Okay, so another one is gonna be this. I do have other ones just like this, but I don't have a long one like this. So I found this long one. I was trying to see if they, uh, they brought another one, whoever had donated this. Maybe they did clusters of these all and I was looking and looking. And no, this was the only one. So this one I picked up for $1.99. I was real excited when I found this one actually. You know me, I love to organize and change things out in my drawers. Great for makeup, even like utensils in the kitchen. And then I also found last but not least, look guys, <laughs> it's a pink retractable dog leash. And this one was really nice too. Uh, yeah, I just, I don't know, I like it. <laughs> so it's just kind of like an extra thing. But I think that that is it. I'm just making sure I'm looking all around. Yeah, so I'm hoping that you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you did. Let me know like if you thought this video was entertaining. Hold on, let me pick you up a little bit. Let me know if you liked this video. Did you get some inspiration? What was your favorite item that you liked? from the items I chose and I picked up for this Goodwill thrifting haul series. Yeah, I would love to know. It's gonna be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, I will see you on the next one. Bye.